I don't have that open right now, but you'll have to give me a moment. Uh -oh. and I'll... All it's right, you're in the front. What are we doing? I know. Hold on. Okay. Oh, number Come nine. I, it's all under yeah. control. I've got number it. Number nine. You just sit there and all look okay. pretty. Take your time. And I'll read number nine. Right. We'll take a number break. Number nine, let's start and finish with some nature videos today. Uh, this one comes from Solar Whisper Daintree River Crocodile and Wildlife Cruises oh, in wow. Australia. Okay. The uh, in the center of your screen, you will see a crocodile go up and grab a bat that's flying by. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, see it there? I did, yeah. They could have turned the lights on. Yeah, it's hard to see. Kind of inconsiderate of them to do so. Oh, yeah. Man. Yikes. That's a big bat. Circle of life there. Jeez. Yeesh. All right. All right. Mm. <laughs> Number eight, forget the Juro spider. I wasn't thinking about the Juro spider. Uh, it's because oh. you're on vacation. Oh. But if you want to really lose sleep at night, take a good look at the Texas giant red-headed centipede. Oh, it can grow up to eight inches long, oh. and all 20 of its legs Horrifying. can unleash venom. Wow. The red-headed centipede likes to snack on lizards, but it can snatch flying insects right out of the air. And here's the thing. This giant monster can yeah. bite humans, too, which can lead to swelling, headaches, and nausea. As yeah. far as we know, they're only in Texas, of course, the Texas red-headed centipede. Huh. Huh. Two uh, kind of animal pet stories back to right back. Right uh, exactly. Let's see if we can get three in here. Uh, number seven, this is gearing up to be the summer of the statement sandal. Oh. It's about time. Yeah. <laughs> From sky-high platforms to cute little kitten heels, it's time yeah. for your feet to take center uh, stage. There you go, Robin. Oh, gosh. Why should your skirts and dresses have all the fun? Yeah. It's impossible not to look away when you're wearing one of these stunning little slippers. But with a statement sandal comes some responsibility. Yeah. Keep those tootsies nice and soft. Stop. Please Remember, stop. Pedicure is your friend. Stop. You can derail your entire look with janky looking feet. Stop so it. Get that taken care of first. I wish we had an example of what janky looking feet were. No. Some of the people, <laughs> Thank you. You know, if you guys in the yeah. control room want to pull no. up, just so yeah. we can't tell the people right. not to have janky Stop. feet and not My show them watching. She'd what be like, janky feet she look might like. Call me now and say, Paul, what are janky feet? Wow. I'm moving on. Number six, if you want to ride the wave this summer, you're going to need a permit. Do you know what I'm talking about? No. We mean hike at the Vermilion Cliffs National Monument in Arizona. They call it riding the wave. It's considered one of the most coveted hikes in the Southwest, but you can't just show up there. All right. You need to register in advance, enter your name in a lottery. And here's why. The land is very fragile, can only host up to 20 hikers a day, and it's a day hike, so no camping or overnight stays are allowed. So if you're interested, you think you can handle it, you can register at recreation.gov. Mm. No thanks. <laughs> and number five, is anyone familiar with the dish called the Slinger at Diner Grill on Irving Park Road no. in Lakeview? Oh. There it is. Oh, it looks great. Uh, but what first off, it? this place is an institution that's been open oh, since yeah, 1939. Been all the time. They have delicious pancakes and sandwiches, and they even have a great patio no since they rebuilt from a fire a few years back. Right. The thing to get very late at night is the Slinger. Slinger sounds good. It's two hamburger patties, two sunny side up eggs, cheese hash browns, onions covered with chili, and served with a side of toast. Over the years, they've had a few versions of the certificate you get if you manage to finish it. And if the certificate has a cartoon of a guy on a toilet, it must be pretty amazing. Oh, no. <laughs> chili is a special recipe. Owner Arnold DeMar told the Tribune, my father bought the chili recipe off a hooker for a hundred bucks. Boy, how does that come yeah. up in conversation? I don't know. I mean, I know you, well, I've heard right. you negotiate a lot of things yeah. with the lady of the yeah. night. I didn't think recipe. chili yeah. recipes were one of them. Wow. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> what does an extra hundred bucks get me? <laughs> how about a chili recipe? <laughs> you got a deal. <laughs> I was on the fence until the chili recipe, yeah. but then... Now, Larry, what would it cost? Could I pay you $100 to eat the slinger? Would you eat? That seems I'd like something... For, I'd do it for 100 bucks. Would 100. you finish it? Would 100. you finish it? I, I haven't seen it. There's no, I needed to put your head next to that dish to see how see big, how big it, it is. was. Well, you know, this mm -hmm. is interesting. See what we can make, Larry. Listen. Yeah. 
Wow. A beer and a half in, and he'll agree to a lot of things. <laughs> You're right about that. You're right about uh, that. Number four, here's a very short video. There's a new device that will help you out if you're running from the cops. Check it out. Oh, oh I've seen this guy. <laughs> but who's got that with them? Yeah, and who yeah, happens to be in a warehouse? You know, yeah, you gotta. You gotta know, really keep that with you. Incredible. Incredible. Well, that is good. <laughs> Stay there for a long time. All right, number three. Let's talk about doppelbanging. Oh. Yeah. It's a hot new term for dating someone who looks oh. just like you. Think Tom Brady or Giselle or Justin Timberlake and Jessica Biel. If you're doppled banging, your significant other might have similar cheekbones or eyebrows. Maybe you both have the same hair color or body type, stuff like that. Don't be surprised either if, according to relationship scientists, women are sometimes attracted to men whose faces look like their fathers. Oh, that's Whoa. Nice. Oh. That gets really at complicated all. complicated there. Well, I got to tell you, I was uh, I spent some time with my parents, yeah. you know, uh, they have been, you know, hanging out in Florida for a while, and I saw an old picture of my father that, did you ever see one, a stumble around one of those pictures you haven't yeah. seen? Yeah. When my father was 36, you and he got like a you? hole in one, right? I'm telling you, yeah. frightening. <laughs> How much he Just, looked like you? He, no, he no. didn't. And like when you think, oh, 36, you think, I don't picture, I always yeah. thought he yeah. looked old. Yeah. He was technically young, but I'm like, he really looked like an old 36. It's like, it's yeah. just really. 36. And really. I don't know. You just had such. A, I had such a different picture of what my dad looked yeah. like at that age. I'm like, you think he looked up. younger when you were a kid, or because I just got a bunch of pictures from my parents from I my grandmother. I thought he would have looked more athletic. I always yeah. said, I mean, he's a good athlete, but it just like he looked kind of old, uh, kind of like this. I gotta have my mom take a picture of this. <laughs> <laughs> the picture. I should have taken a picture of the picture. But it's like, that's just a weird thing when you stumble on yeah. a picture like that. Mm. Oh. All right. Anyway, well, I didn't mean to derail the train. Yeah, no, I don't no, know no, where no, that no, came no, from. All right. Story, yeah. All right, number two, check this out. It's a guardrail cleaning truck. It's from a Chinese company called Fulongma. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is a satisfying. Yeah. This is a problem. We can clean all these up. Turn things around. With every penny, right? Look at that. That's civic pride right there. There it is. Yeah, if you don't care about the little things, you're not going to care about the big things. True. You're darn right. However that goes. All right. Uh, have we seen enough of that? Yeah. yeah. Sure. Number one, from the Twitter feed, Nature is Scary. Here are some short videos strung together. Oh, no. Wait, what happened? Is that a puppy? <gasps> what the? Boom! Is the bear hiding from the dog? Yeah, yeah both the bear, of them. Bear was no you get out of here. Oh, no. Oh! oh. What was that? What was that? Oh, oh, I don't want to know what that was. Oh, it's still what going. is going on? Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's coming up real close now, isn't it? Whoa! Uh-oh. Oh. Not oh, today. Is Not today. Get back in there. <laughs> Not today. Whoa, those are some reflexes. <laughs> <laughs> Whee! Ooh, look wow. at that. That's that, a quick first step. Oh, no. Oh, no. What is what this? What is going on? Oh, that's a, that doesn't look right. What the heck? What? Uh, oh, it's uh, a camping. <laughs> it's a tent. <laughs> Well, you got your what is going? <laughs> Did you see wow. that? Oh my God! Just going out for a swim. Wait! Oh no! Oh, nature is scary. Just a sure, yeah. storm. That's a tornado. That's not stuff, as yeah. fun there for yeah. sure. Jeez. Oh, is that the end of it? Oh no! Uh -oh. oh, come on! What, what is going on my here? Life. What are you what? talking about? Oh. Face only a mother could look. <laughs> that was fun. Wow. That's a nine and nine. Yes. Yeah.